No, 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 man. No, you, you take your leave, man. If you need, if you need to go, I can handle it. All right, all right, all right. All right who, who I'm King just letting K you know, King K versus Cookie Slayer. I don't, I don't care. I know Zan's super chill. I know he's a cool guy. I'm still gonna be, uh, you know, hella biased towards my yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. There you go. I'll be, I'll be, uh, I'll be for the purpose of balance, uh, biased for Cookie Slayer. However, of course, moving to Texas next semester, I want to be biased for Cookie Slayer. <laughs> Stick, stick with whatever feels right, man. I'm not I'm not going to knock you if you decide to be biased with me with King K because he is <laughs> yeah, sick. Yeah, he's so sick. And, and we saw it the last game, and we'll probably see something this game too. But, of course, what? how is it going to change the matchup? You know, both characters are extremely set-up characters, and both characters have really great ledge pressure and projectiles in general. Well, I think the big I think the big matter of this uh, that's going to define this matchup is uh, very very little in the neutral because like you said these two have very similar tools to go up against each other in those situations but rather it's that disadvantage state it's when you have your opponent caught in those combos and those juggles how are you going to continue to keep that rolling as either one of these characters and that will define this matchup King K wants to go wow, straight he, he, to the punch he really just dude. wants the up smash oh he, my god he, every he, single time he's really been doing it Dude, he wants to he wants to bypass the disadvantage completely. He <laughs> says, "Just give me the next stock. Let's play neutral, buddy." Oh, and unfortunately, missing the punish on the on the uh, side B. Um, you know, one of the crucial things is uh, is will his up smash if he times it right be able to be out? Who gyro cares? Kills. Who cares about the up gyro smash, kills. my friend? It's the gyro that's gonna net King K that first stock. Wow. Incredible. Seriously. Oh, but. Down tilt to up special that is continually an old classic oh, for yeah. Cookie Slayer, and he takes the stock there. And we see more of the patented Rob Mares coming out. And, uh, oh, this is going to be juicy. Up, grounded up B to aerial up B. Mm -hmm. What an incredible combination. Uh, we see Rob with a fully charged laser attempting to uh, uh, release it, unfortunately being stopped by every boomerang and arrow known to man. Wow, the damage is just racked up on Rob so quickly. 126% already with uh, uh, the young Link Cookie Slayer being a uh, relatively low percent. Yeah, dude, I uh, I look I look down to text my ride about going home. I looked up and King K is at 141%. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. That is ridiculous. He uses that back air down all the way below the stage to stall his recovery so that he can get back and uh, you know just sort of mask it, but oh. without any fuel left. Cookie Slayer just kept hitting him over and over and over until he died. Yeah. And that's probably going to be the name of the game. Can Cookie Slayer get rid of this Rob for its semi-linear? Amazing, the semi-linear recovery. Mm -hmm. and, and with no hitbox to cover himself on the way up, he has to rely on doing a rising up air or something to punish somebody for hitting him. That'll give him the time he needs to get back to the stage. Or Next. at least to the ledge. Wow, he catches him with the meatiest of meaties with the side B. <laughs> Uh, okay. Oh, I'm interested. Afraid as the of the down throw. Yeah. I'm. I'm Ooh. guessing. Wow. Down. Down at a two frame, oh. baby. He's got it. But I think he was probably just afraid of that. Uh, that match that Cookie Slayer yeah, showed him earlier. Yeah. That was an incredible match earlier, and I don't think we talked about it enough. But you know, that's going to be something that's huge in this matchup on the young link side, of course. We're Plenty of opportunities to set up ledge traps for young link, though, man. Oh, and the air dodge in is going to be punished by a fair, just to repeat the situation. That down air going to save him because uh, King K really loves that side bit of the ledge. It probably covers so many options. Yeah, no, using arm rotor, it normally works against a lot of characters that don't have disjoints as a, as a really good anti air. But against the young link, that he has that disjoint on that down air, so it doesn't work quite as well. What a perfectly timed spot dodge that was there. Incredible. Getting to get around the down tilt, oh, that's, that's going to be it. The Fair chase from Cookie day, Slayer. Incredible. What an incredible game. I love watching them just dodge and uh, weave around each other. Mm -hmm. Not a whole lot of dodging and weaving to do when you got a big body like Rob does. <laughs> yeah, at some point, you know, with the heavier characters, or at least with the bigger characters, you kind of got to shut up and take it. Got it. All right, this will be the this will be the last uh, the last game of the set that gets commentated, unfortunately, because I think we all got to start get going when it's yeah. uh, when it's about midnight. You know, venues venues getting close to going, and actually, you're going to be heading out. So, yeah, you know, I'll stick I'll stick to my promise. I'll uh, I'll go ahead and just kind of solo commentate this. It'll be chill. We'll hang out. It'll be like a, it'll be like I'm live streaming or something. You know, it'll be a it'll be a, oh or Vance can get back on and we can have some real stuff to finish this out. Yeah, I'm into it. Let's finish this, man. Whatever, I gotta, I gotta be, I gotta be going. I gotta be out of the, out of the building at like 11:55 because I gotta go get my bag from the car. But like up until then, let's talk about King K versus Cookie Slayer because that game one tight. This game two starting off dead even. Yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, man. It's 
not every day so got fights. Fights a good rob. <laughs> we have no good robs, and that was such a great down air. It immediately puts down right down on the level. You you uh you gotta respect that downer the same way that you're gonna respect an Ivysaur downer. If you see that rob above you and you're at ledge, you gotta know that it's coming and you gotta wait for it to come out before you have a chance to come back. Cookie Slayer not gonna find that final connection on that upbeat though. So close. Oh, almost gets the tech chase with the down tilt and immediately there's the neutral right out there. Down oh, so, oh that was so close. Yo man, you are <laughs> messing with danger. Dude, King K is the danger. What are you talking about? You don't wanna mess with this man. Oh, nice. Ooh. It looked like he trying to go for like a classic like jackhammer move there, but fortunately the bounce allowed King K to actually react that shield. Yeah, it was a really, really nice punishment. I, 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 didn't, I wouldn't have been brave enough to, to challenge that at all. Yeah. Rob's got some pretty good frame data on his tilts. That right there, Cookie Slayer going to even up the stocks, and this could be his start for the combos. Waits for that jump. That's all he wanted King K to do, and taking him coast to coast to coast. Even taking the lead at this point. Last laser and he's forced to go low. King K with the ledge guard here, but just holds the shield straight up. She's gonna be just looking at this guy. Yo, Yo, this is almost with a snipe though. That would have been amazing. The Texas sniper and he literally eliminates this man off the side. Hold the phone. Is he gonna man. do it again? No, he got so greedy. I thought he was just gonna try to medium with the side B and the disjoints again coming in for Cookie Slayer. Okay. Unbelievable. Zan knows what he has Yo! to do. That was good. That was such a great move. You're kidding me. He literally caught King K right before he threw out the laser at that point. He was like, hold up. If you want the end mic from that, be my guest. Let me get these arrows first. This man, you've heard of a double tap. This man hit him with a triple tap. He gets him off the ledge. I thought he was going to go for an up off the side just to show him who's boss. He wants the highlight. He wants to be part of two. He, didn't, he didn't want it enough. Yeah. He didn't want it enough, my dude. King K would have gone for the arm murder there every day of the week. And the fact that Cookie oh. Slayer didn't, I call that weak. <laughs> hey, oh should have done it. Put, put some respect on this man's name. Oh, like, no, he's he's winning. Yeah. But he's winning in a he's winning, uh, he's in winning a like this. Okay, there he's we go. Yeah, there, yeah, there. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm saying. You got to go for it. You just have to put all, you just literally have to whip out, the, whip out the wallet, put all the cash on the table, and say, you know what? Rub that nose, smirk off your face. I'm going to get game two. Losers finals. Will we see the 818 battle it out? Put the, put the chips on the table, baby. Yeah, that's what that's what Cookie Slayer yeah. did. Like he was take, he was the money he was going wallet, with like yeah. he was he was doing checks, he was doing calls, he maybe do like one raise, but that time he's like, look, all right, like I feel like I can win this all in. That's what I want to see. Yeah. If you're gonna go for it, go for it. He didn't even bet chips anymore at this point. He just took, he took out the fresh hundred dollar bill. He was like, yo, man, my chips <laughs> worth nothing until I get this hundred dollar bill wasted. Zan going for broke at that point. 20 and no handshake to sell. Let's see what King K's reaction is here. And Zan knows giving King K all the respect, all that distance, all that spacing will only allow him to get his game plan. Yeah, and that's why that's why it's interesting that we've gone back to Smashville. You know, we saw that Zan played a really good, really uh, tight up close game that wasn't giving King K time to breathe and set up that projectile pressure that he normally does to set up for those crazy Rob combos that he has. Oh, uh, so going back to Smashville, I'm interested to to kind of understand like, okay, do Wait I just want to run back? Yeah. yeah. Zan's definitely really good at just waiting for any sort of landing. Uh, Young Link in general is as well, but Zan, you know, just knows the kind of game plan that he needs to execute with this character. Drops the bomb, man. Okay, Zan, with another bomb here. No Z drop here, but he merely goes for the class up. The this bomb almost saved him. <laughs> yeah, man, the bomb only not even working. Oh boy, that back air has got some heft to it. So King K gonna take the lead here. Gonna have a lead here in game three, but now that he's running out of fuel, he's gotta use that oh. back air and the air dodge to recover. If he gets hit off stage, this is bad for him because he is still running low on fuel. You can see on that torso of Rob, Cookie Slayer just had to take advantage of that. Oh, and man. with a with a with a little bit of the squats. He gives this man the online tea bag. Cause somewhere in the other line, Sakurai thought it was funny to just eliminate taunts from online play. If you were a real young player, he'd pull out the milk. Yeah, he'd pull out the two percent. I, 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 I get, I get my milk like a real man does, man. Ooh. All the fat in my milk does not matter. Look at that soy. I want all the fat. Ooh. I want all the weight gone. Plenty of, plenty of weight to that downer, man. Yep. Send you, send you packing. King K has a pretty big lead now, and it's up to him to continue to oh. activate that game plan that he's had this whole way through. Gets him with the with the uh, inside hitbox, the uh, the the uh, with the actual like eyes yeah. of the of the laser, which does do extra burn damage. Okay, he has his gyro back, and he's actually able to use it to get himself out of the corner. But once again, Young Link's got so much frame data to put you right back there. It's just up to Cookie Slayer okay. to find the kill. Does he know? 
No kill, no gets, rage. The, gets the corner carry and he puts him off the stage. What's going to be his reaction from the ledge? And great Nutra out of the shield there. Wanted to make sure he had his guard. Great parry. Bomb drop there and nothing. Only to see how King K was going to react and missing the mark. Ooh, aggressive forward air to cover King K's advance back on stage. He waits for that gyro to come back and then pulls it out. Oh. But an aggressive landing from Cookie Slayer evens up the stocks. It's even stocks, but not even percentage. Okay. I was gonna say like, yo, King K, I don't know what you're going for there, but if you, if Zan somehow fell to it, more to you. Ooh, drag him in with the arm rotor. King K's got a chance for an edge guard, but the delay on the recovery been working out for Cookie Slayer so far. Drops the bomb, nice. Able to get through that armor from the side. He intangible only from the sides. This is Zan's big play here. Can he cash all the chips and take it home with a 30 and a handshake? That's the question here. And he's able to power through that laser, get away from the side. I mean, this is coming literally just down to the wire, man. If I, I would be scared, man, because I feel like I'm watching an episode of Game of Thrones where I don't know how it's going to end. Heck, excellent. Oh, Chaka my God. King Sam K. with the last hit. He goes for it, man. And that was perfectly played there from Cookie Slayer <laughs> because he knows if he immediately goes and holds down on that upbeat, King K is probably going to buffer anything to get back on stage as quickly as possible oh, yeah. after a panic scenario is set up for him. 